of the Jason Tawney Show. I'm Joe Wombo, joined now with Jason Tawney, head coach of the baseball team. And, Coach, we get to talk about some victories over a nationally ranked team, your 20th and 21st career victories over a nationally ranked team, and couldn't have come at a better time against Alvernia. Yeah, we, we absolutely needed those Ws. I would like to have gotten a third one against them, but, uh, you know, uh, that's being a little greedy. But, yeah, being able to beat them twice, we swept them in a doubleheader on senior day. Um, on Sunday, uh, tremendous victories, mm-hmm. you know, tremendous play by the team. And, yeah, 20th and 21st win over a nationally ranked team. Um, we really need them to make ourselves viable to, to make a run for that last conference spot. So we still need some help this weekend, mm-hmm. and we need to take care of business. But uh, we definitely like the two wins we got. Yeah, if you want to talk about some postseason possibilities, you guys need to sweep and need a little bit of help from other teams. But first, like as you mentioned, you got to take care of business. Yeah, we – we got to take care of our side. You know, we got we got to take it to Messiah. Um, we're capable of sweeping them. We're capable mm-hmm. of sweeping anybody we play. Um, so we're capable of it. But then, yeah, we're going to need some help. Uh, so if uh, if anybody from Albright's listening, we could we could definitely use a sweep from Albright as well. Uh, that that's the the one the one path to the mm-hmm. the MAC tournament we have right now. Um, you know, as of going into yesterday's game, it was kind of kind of crazy. Um, we could finish as of yesterday. Could have finished anywhere from second to sixth that's a, that's a broad spectrum so, yeah it's very broad and, and it was about us sweeping and winning out and some other teams doing some work we could have finished second and of course if we don't play well obviously then we'd be down the sixth area but uh it, it's it's a crazy year this year in this conference yeah, you guys have definitely proved yourselves a little bit with that those victories against alvernia how do you continue that play you know look past the the speed bump and the buzzsaw they ran into with yeah. the alvernia pitcher on monday but how do you continue that play to to keep getting those opportunities to get in the postseason. Yeah, that's a that's a great question uh, because we've we've shown throughout the year at times we can play at that level. You know, we uh, we lost to Cortland, who was number two in the country, mm-hmm. five four in the bottom of the ninth. You know, so we're, we're capable of playing at that level consistently. It's always about a play here or a play there. Something we try to emphasize to the guys. It might be a pitch here or a pitch there. Um, you know, hopefully we can keep that up. You know, I, I know one of my uh, one of my players said to me after the game, he's like, I don't understand our team. Why why we can play like this against these guys, and then there's other teams we just don't play as well. And a lot of it comes down to some some young mistakes mm-hmm. that we make. And you know, and I said it, I think I said it last week or the week before. We're we're in a little bit of a rebuilding year, so we have a lot of freshmen we're depending on. And you know, yesterday was an example. We were playing, uh, ran to the buzz solve a pitcher through through a terrific game. Um, for for Alvernia, but uh, you know I had two freshmen on the mound that threw mm-hmm. all nine innings and uh, threw the ball well. Right. You know, so we're hoping that's a building point going forward, a building spot. You know, and actually uh, going into the ninth inning, we only had two hits, both by freshmen. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. so so you know it's uh, you know I I think that that's the good side of it. The bad side is it make a lot of freshman mistakes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, sometimes it comes down to you know throwing the right pitch into the right spot. You know, you yeah. may throw the pitch and get the break on it that you want, but it needs to hit where it needs for the defense to be able to make a play and, as well. And that's learning. Mm-hmm. You know, that's what, you know, as a freshman, that's, that's the reason why it's tough to depend on freshmen in our sport is there's some nuances to mm-hmm. the game that you need to understand, and that's one of them. Um, we've struggled with that at times this right. year. It's not that the stuff's not good enough. It's sometimes it's location mm-hmm. or if we're making a purpose pitch and trying to set up another pitch and we – get too much of the plate or it's not as high as we want or, or whatever. Um, those are some of the growing pains you have to live through. But I, I can tell you for those guys specifically, as sophomores, it's going to be a whole nother level for them. Oh, definitely. I hope they, that's, that's the goal. They learn from that and take themselves to a whole nother level. You guys have a lot of optimism in the youth of your team. It could be a growing pain season, but you're growing Yeah, is the, is the point. Yeah. We are, we are, and you know we're we're still we're still sitting in a spot where you know after this weekend we hope to be at twenty wins. Mm-hmm. Um, still got a ch- chance to get to the conference tournament. Once you're in, you yeah. never know what can happen. Uh, which means if we can get to that point, we still have a chance at NCAA's mm-hmm. and at a, at a lesser level ECACs. You know there are all possibilities out there. So a lot of our team goals are still there, mm-hmm. um, even though we have such a young young team right now. Yeah, it's a lot of optimism heading into this weekend and we wish you the best of luck this week and safe travels everywhere you're going thank you he's jason tawny i'm joe wamba and this has been the jason tawny show